Leaders at UNF are dealing with what they describe as a racist incident involving these QR codes. They say the codes are on stickers placed around campus. And when they're scanned, they link to white supremacist and anti-Semitic websites. School officials say that the stickers were placed during the Jewish Passover holiday. News for Jack supporter Eric Avenier is joining us from the campus with reaction. Eric. Yeah, school leaders say those stickers were placed inside Building 59, which is just behind me. And then if you go right next door here to Building 51, they say those stickers were placed inside there as well. Many students we spoke with say this was totally unacceptable. UNF school leaders say these stickers containing QR codes with links to racist and anti-Semitic propaganda were attached to doors of multiple Jewish professors inside this social science building and this biology building. UNF issued a written statement that says the codes were distributed during Passover. Kelvin Mary is a student from East Africa. He says he found out about the stickers through an email that went out to all the students. I was shocked as anybody else can be and um, that's pretty unacceptable. Michael Korakov is a Jewish uh, student who also just learned about what happened. Um, I was kind of shocked because uh, I don't know why, why, why would you spread the message of something bad out there. Rabbi Jonathan Loopliner of the Jacksonville Jewish Center was not surprised. He says this isn't the first time someone has attempted to spread messages of hate and it won't be the last. He also says heated politics has allowed certain segments of our society to openly express their views of people they deem different. Uh, there is unfortunately uh, discrimination and bigotry from both extremes of the political spectrum. Um, each one is, is different but each is, is also rooted in a, a very narrow and intolerant view of, of the other. Now, in a statement released by UNF tonight, that statement goes on to say that the person responsible has been identified as a current student, and the incident has been referred to the Office of Equal Opportunity and Inclusion and Student Conduct. Reporting live from the campus of UNF, Eric Avenier, Channel 4, The Local Station.